So the original sculpture was, was done using a large 13-ton block of Indiana limestone. Warnicke actually uh, created the sculpture on site in front of everyone to, you know, to see. They could come in and look at the work being done day to day. So we have historic photos from this time period, and one of these photos actually shows the actual chips that came off of the lion as Warnicke worked at, in a pile at the base. And this was before topsoil was added and the mulch mound was added um, afterward. And so with Phil's new stonework, we knew that we needed to install a concrete footing or foundation for, for this stone. And so our guys uh, excavated around the base of the lion and lo and behold found the chips still there uh, where Wernicke left them you know, 70 some years ago.